Welcome back and following on from yesterday's video where we overscanned the Phantom ship today I'm just going to demonstrate how to use the crop filter in virtual dub and because this is a large frame scan uh, it's taken up most of my window so we can right click in this area and resize this window to anything we like and you can do it by clicking and dragging and get something that you're comfortable with by default, Virtual Dub will play any content at 10 frames per second, so the first thing I'm going to do is go Video Frame Rate and choose a frame rate for this. And I want to change the frame rate, and I'm going to type in 18 frames per second and OK that, so that will now play at the correct speed. The next thing I want to do is crop out the light table from the scanner, so we just end up, or maybe we'll go down to the frame as I did yesterday. Um, so for that we need to go to Video and Filters, and we're going to add a crop and if we scroll down there's the crop and we'll OK that and it gives me this preview window which again is huge so I'm going to make that slightly smaller so I can see what I'm doing and it's not immediately obvious how to crop this there's nothing there to, to, to give you a, a hand but simply all you do is move the mouse to the top and drag it down to where you want the crop to happen same from the bottom from the right hand side and from the left hand side one thing you should note, it's showing you over here on the left what you're cropping it to. And these must be even numbers. So you see here the top, 541. If I try and process that now, it will fail at the export stage. It has to be a multiple of two, an even number. And then once we've done that, we OK that and OK that. And here's our cropped version. And let's make this a little bit larger so you can see it. So that's cropped everything out. And then from that point, we simply choose our video compression. And your list of codecs here may differ from what you're seeing on mine. I'm going to choose the 264 codec, which is set to 9000, which is fine. We choose OK. And then we save the video as and give it a name and save it out. Job done. Thanks for watching. See you next time.